Greetings and welcome to RuralVacantLand.com. This is Luke Smith and today I'd like to show you a 30 acre property I've got for sale in San Bernardino County, California. So San Bernardino County is in Southern California and I'm going to show you where we're at. This is where the property's at. It's Colorado River over here in the corner. Um, so we zoom out. You can see uh, San Diego, Los Angeles, Las Vegas, Phoenix, Turtle Mountains over in here. You can go hunting and a um, bunch of BLM land, a whole bunch of area to go explore over here. There's federal lands, there's all kinds of, that gets into Joshua Tree, that's a super park. But these other BLM lands, you go hiking and camping and hunting and, and stuff. There's just a lot of nature around this area. So if we zoom in on this property, you know, off to the side you got the Colorado River where you can go boating and fishing and having fun in the water. And to the west you can go up in the mountains and have fun in the mountains. So we got an aqueduct that runs through here and uh, there's a bunch of little crossings of the aqueduct where uh, you know the berms have focused water to go through these crossings you get get these bridge slash ditch things you can, you can drive through to get through there 99% of the time less less it's raining out um, you can go across there and you can get into this vast wilderness and in this vast wilderness is 30 acres in this funny colored patch of land right over here uh, if we zoom in on it, you can see all kinds of all kinds of two tracks and trails where people have been driving around, exploring, and having fun in this area. See people just drive back and forth and around and around. Probably camp out here and just have fun, right? Um, well, now it's your land. You can make it yours. You can do what you want here, and it looks like you can drive right in because all these other people have. Uh, let's look at the market. It's in San Bernardino County, California. I went and I sliced it up to 25 acres and up and priced low to high. There's one guy out here, David Crook, he's got a property, $4,999. Um, I don't know why that one's so cheap, but uh, so mine I got 30 acres, 6749 You should probably look at him, look at mine, go tour these ones and make up your mind. Mine's pretty darn cheap, this is really cheap. Um, then everyone else gets up into, what are you thinking prices? But mine, 6749 for 30 acres near the Colorado River. From this property to the local gas station, 23 miles. There's a Circle K. Best part is it's in Arizona. You can go over to Arizona, get your gas, probably pay a dollar a gallon less to get gas in Arizona than in California. You can buy groceries right across the street, the Walmart Super Center, um, all kinds of other supplies in this, this area that you can buy without paying California taxes and you can live in the California side with the California social system and it's a lot easier in lots of ways to live in California as long as you don't have to pay the taxes you go buy stuff in Arizona and skip out on the taxes. Um, taxes on this property are like seventy dollars a year. Uh, so from here to Lake Havasu City where you've got boating and fishing and all kinds of river fun games and other supplies and stuff. I mean you can get in the river closer but this is like the epicenter of, of river activity. 61 miles. Palm Springs, which I'm sure you've heard of, is just backside of LA. That's 133 miles. They have a couple different routes to get there. Las Vegas, which everybody knows why you go to Las Vegas. That's 166 miles to the north. Take the 95, you shoot straight up north and um, go to Las Vegas, downtown Las Vegas. That's an easy weekend trip. So the weather in this area right now, we're, we're uh, you know, what's today's date? November 7th is today's date. And, uh, you know, this is November. It's 85 degrees in Lake Havasu City. That's a little further north than this property. It might even be a little warmer at the property. But the forecast, I mean, it gets down to maybe 66. There's a forecast in there. Uh, later on this week, but there's some 85s and it goes starts going back up in the higher 70s again. It's pretty nice weather Low wind low humidity No rain no clouds not a cloud in the sky clear blue 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 sky every day look at this 80 80 80 80 80 80 80 you know the highs are looking looking up into the 80s every day it gets cooler at night makes it easier to sleep but warms you up in the daytime I like that kind of weather. So, Lake Havasu City, I pulled up pictures of Lake Havasu City, and uh, you know, they've got the got the old London Bridge, and they've got, 
you know, just a lot of crazy stuff. People on every kind of water sports activity you can think of having fun in the water. People come here from all over the place, and they just have fun in the water. That's what people do. During the week, you can get out there. There's no one around. You know, nice quiet fishing time. Weekend gets a little more hectic. Spring break, it goes off the hook, and it starts looking like this. But, uh, you know, other times, you just just pick your pick the part of the river that you want to go and go and have it to yourself. So that's 30 acres, San Bernardino County, for sale on ruralvacantland.com. Just go to ruralvacantland.com, go to the listings, and pick out the property you want. This one, 30 acres, 6749 You click on that, and then you go down and click here to buy now, and you check out with it. And uh, this doesn't say the right stuff here, but I'm going to go fix that right after this video. Thanks for listening, thanks for watching, and hope to talk to you soon.